Number 30. What is the spacing between structures in a feather that acts as a reflection grading given that they produce a first order maximum for 525 nanometer light at a 30 degree angle? So basically they're asking us the distance between the slits, okay? Um, so what we need to do here is uh, we need to find, well, D, all right? It's a uh, first order maximums, they're constructive, and that's why I'm dealing with the constructive formula here. So D is equal to sine theta times the order multiplied by the wavelength. In order for me to solve for D there, we're gonna divide out sine of theta from both sides. There's your formula. And now all you need to do is just simply plug in the values. So this is D is equal to first order times now the wavelength of 525 nanometers. I'm just gonna convert that into meters. And then divide that now by the sine of 30 degrees. And let's see what we get. So this is 525 times 10 to the minus ninth divided then by sine of 30, make sure your calculator is in degree mode. And this works out to be about 1.05 times 10 to the minus sixth meters. That's the spacing between them. If you had to, you know, convert that into micrometers, you know what to do. So that's that. Guys, thanks for tuning in. Hopefully that helps. Check out some more videos. We got chemistry pre-calculus out there. We got a whole bunch of stuff coming. So, um, and we work through specific problems. So if you're using OpenStax books, that's perfect. But even if you're not, Download them anyway, they're free. And I guarantee you'll be able to find a very similar problem, if not identical problem in there. And uh, we'll be able to help you with other subjects too. All right, specifically. Guys, thanks for tuning in. See you soon.